Hello. Uh, tutorial now for Noel Gallagher's Alone on the Rope. This one, I think, is the B-side to AKA What a Life, isn't it? This one's an easy one. Capo on the second fret. There's only really two parts you need to learn for the whole song. The intro, the verse, and the chorus all use two chords. Same two chords. C major 7 and an E minor. So C major 7 is 3, 3, 2, open, open, open. And your E minor is open, second, second, open, open, open. Alright. Now, on the intro and where there are no uh, intro and um, solo parts, you can throw in a little um, little extra bit, which I'll show you. Then there's a, a little, I think, you, I guess you call it a middle eight, um, where we've got a couple of extra chords. So anyway, so the two chords, as I said, C major seven, and that's what it starts on. And play it with this shape, and I'll show you why shortly. Um, second finger onto the fourth uh, string, second fret. Third finger onto the bottom E on the third fret, fourth finger onto the uh, fifth string on the third fret. So you C major that way. The reason I say that is because your pinky is going to need to play the fourth string on the fourth fret occasionally. So. but it does sound better um, in the parts at least where you're not singing. So, intro. What you're going to do is just keep releasing on and off that fourth string. So... saying about putting the um, pinky onto the fourth string. Up, down, up, down, up. Strum the C minor, a C major, seven. Then bring your pinky up onto the fourth string. Play it um, on the fourth fret. Then open the fourth string altogether. Then back to your E minor. And when you play your E minor, I generally play it this way, but Play it that way because again you need to have that pinky free for the fourth um, fret there. Open fourth, C major seven. It's optional, you can just play the two chords if you find that too hard. changes to chords at all for the first few minutes of that song. So only when you get to the, you know, I'm calling it a middle late, I don't really know if it really is strictly, but <laughs> you can leave when the walls fall down. That's where your first change comes in. And all you really need there is a G6. So you're leaving, again, like many old songs, you're leaving the E string, top E, open through the whole song. G6. 
six is three, two, open, 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 open. You can leave when the world's in A sus two here. Open, open, second, second, open, open. Fall down and back to your E minor. Three times in a row. Alright? You can leave when the world's fall down. I can tell. There and then ace us two again. Don't look down. When you're coming out of your middle eight, this is a major seven, and then a D sus two right at the end. Okay, first change of the chord, D sus two. So C major seven, to D sus two, back into your intro. seven to the E minor. And that's the whole song. That's a line on the rope. A pretty easy one. Two parts. There you go.